today we've taken uh, several tours, uh, busloads of folks uh, to visit the base and see what is being planned on the base. Uh, the city is in the middle of a specific planning process uh, to determine uh, how, how the housing and parks and uh, office buildings will ultimately lay out on the base. Uh, we expect uh, to be discussing that over the next 12 months with the idea of bringing a specific plan and an environmental impact report uh, and a, an agreement with our master developer, Lennar Five Point, uh, to the City Council in June of 2019. The area plan that was adopted by the City Council in 2012 envisioned a transit-oriented development, uh, which means higher density development around the North Concord BART station. It envisioned about 12,000 housing units uh, over the 2,300 acres of the project, about 6.1 million square feet of commercial and retail space, a campus district of about 2.3 million square feet of campus stuff, uh, a, a tournament sports complex in Great City Park, as well as a regional park and conservation area. So overall, over 30 years, there's a significant amount of recreational area, uh, educational institutions, offices, jobs, opportunities, and both market rate and affordable housing planned for the base. Look, this is uh, the, the largest project of its type in the Bay Area. It's a, it's a legacy project and, and uh, it will create a lot of uh, opportunity both in terms of employment, in terms of housing, uh, and in terms of recreation for Concord. And, and it'll make Concord uh, a destination location.